to you to the veterans extremely well. Um, the numbers, though, you're you're probably spending almost 600 hours with general assistance, and my thought, my my instincts tell me uh, the the need that you have for veteran services and the the expertise and the uh, understanding that you have for veterans' needs is something I would like to try to get to 100%. And so that's, that's just kind of a comment, but uh, absolutely you know, happy with the work and results that have been occurring so far in your department. So thank you. In reference to that, do, does anyone feel that you're not supplying any veterans with anything that they should be getting under this current scenario of doing both, are you, are you no. confident that nobody is getting shortchanged on the veterans and hopefully on the GA side of this, uh, the way we're doing things at this time? The only one that takes the longest is GA because with that form that we send, we give them about a week to get all that paperwork ready. Because uh, remember a couple years ago, people would come in our office and then they wouldn't have birth certificates or the information that we're requesting, and then we had to send them away, set up another appointment, they come back. So with this form that we're doing, we give them a, about a week notice. Now with the VA, if you're a veteran you call, I just tell Tammy, open up the calendar, very first very available appointment, put them in, or her, or the family member, or whatever. Just put them in, get them in there as soon as possible. Because I mean, they're in our VINS program, so it's a lot easier. So I can just like, if, you know, if you came in, Daryl, I just pull up your name. I can see all the old transactions that we've done since we had this VINS program. And we go from there, or, you know, bring the paperwork in and I can read it and tell you exactly what our next course of action is gonna be. So with the veterans, we get them in within days. Now the general assistance, like I said though, it takes a week to 10 days depending on uh, how many people we are actually having, but I mean, they're the ones that maybe get shortchanged, but we need all that documentation because of the. Compared to what it used to be, you know, you, your department has really fine tuned the GA process compared to what it was. I mean, for your purposes, it, it still seems like it's arduous and, and, and ridiculous amount of time we spend on it, but compared to what we used to do, this is this is cool beans. Mm -hmm. So, you know, the, the big thing I think is that it's not broke. That we're confident that everybody's getting served in a reasonable fashion, and the vets especially. That being said, I still want to do what you're proposing is, is go through and see if we can't do it better yet. 